hello everyone today i want to show you how to simplify this nice algebraic expression into the simplified form uh, so if we have 17 square minus 15 square and its whole square root and we simplified this algebraic expression into the lowest form and here you see that calculator is not allowed in this problem uh, it means that we will show all of the working on this paper uh, so uh, here uh, we solve this problem for two methods uh, and now here first we discuss our uh, method number one and now uh, I hope so uh, you like both of these methods but if you have any other method in your mind uh, so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. So now here uh, in the first method uh, we solve this problem uh, with the help of this nice algebraic formula uh, you know that if we have a square minus b square it is equals to a minus b times of a plus b so we use this nice formula to simplify the terms and here you have our a is equals to 17 and our b is equals to 15 and now here we need to substitute these two values of a and b in the right hand side of this formula so that uh, according to this formula we expand our uh, uh, given question statement as uh, first you have a minus b here our a is 17 minus b is 15 into uh, again we have a plus b so our a is 17 plus b is 15 and its whole square root so here we need to uh, add or subtract the like terms uh, so that we have this is 17 minus 5 equals to 2 and it is multiplied by this is 17 plus 5 equals to 32 and now in the next step we need to multiply 2 by 32 and it is equals to 2 times of 32 becomes 64 uh, and now here further we uh, write this 64 as in this form it is 8 multiplied by 8 or in other words we write this term as 8 square so you see here this 2 and this square root are gone and we will get here this 8 only and this 8 be the final simplified form of the given algebraic expression so this is the final answer of this question which we get here from first method and now here uh, we move forward and uh, we can again solve this problem for a second method uh, and now here in second method first we need to copy down the given question statement here uh, so that given question statement is 17 square minus 15 square and its whole square root so in the second method uh, we uh, uh, first we uh, rewrite this algebraic expression as here we rewrite this 17 as 15 plus 2 whole square minus we write this 15 square as it is and now here in the next step uh, we again solve this problem uh, with the help of this algebraic formula if you have a plus b whole square it is equals to uh, a square plus b square plus 2 times of a b so now we uh, apply here this nice formula to this term and you see here uh, our a is 15 and our b is 2 and now we put these two values of a and b in the right hand side of this formula uh, so we write uh, the expansion of this formula as in this form first you have a square and our a is 15 square plus we have b square and b is 2 square plus 2 times of a b so here our a is 15 and b is 2 and this is minus 15 square so here we need to uh, cancel uh, uh, the like terms so you have this is minus 15 square and this is the plus 15 square are cancelled out by each other and here we uh, 
uh, get uh, here we need to simplify the other terms so we write this 2 square equals to 4 and plus here you have 2 times of uh, 2 times of 15 is equals to 30 and 30 times of 2 becomes here 60 so uh, here we add 4 plus 60 and you see here 4 plus 60 is equals to 64 and now uh, again uh, we rewrite this 64 as we write 64 as 8 multiplied by 8 and its whole square root or in other words we uh, write this uh, 8 cross 8 write written as 8 square and its whole square root and you see here this 2 and this square root are cancelled out by each other and we will obtain here 8 only so now here uh, in both of these method uh, you see here uh, we again get the uh, same answer uh, so from both methods we get our answer is equals to 8 and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos